I go to page 52 and just let the word, perhaps there's a better way. And it says two distinct different things, but it has one commonality, which is trust. It says either trusting finite self or trusting the infinite. What are we representing there? We're not representing finite self. We're not representing the infinite. We're representing trust or faith, yeah? So we are the faith and how we're going to appear and live is based on what our faith is put in. We have had, we had seen thousands of examples of what a life looks like when faith is put into self, yes? And now, now many of us are a living example of what a life is gonna look like when faith is put into the infinite through the direction of recovery. So here he says, it's the bottom of page 53. They're now talking about stuff for a couple of pages to the agnostic, but he basically says here, but let us think a little more closely without knowing it. This is a lot of the conditions where self fucking thrives. When this idea of self, it loves the condition of us not knowing it. Yeah. Without knowing it, it has a field day. <laughs> Literally, it really does. It's like kids using a pool without the people knowing it. And then we'd always, somehow or another, we'd make too much noise and the lights would go on in the house and we'd have to jump out of the pool and jump over the fence and run. Yeah, because we could only swim without them knowing it. Yeah, as soon as they knew we were there, whoop, we had to take off. So this is sort of like the head. So without knowing it, had we not been brought, see this word brought? It's similar to the word driven. Yeah. Like it says, we are driven by tons of shit. We are brought. So something brings us somewhere. Now the narrative that we're listening to is we brought ourselves there. But he's disagreeing with that. He He's saying that faith actually brought you to where you find yourself. Isn't that incredible? If you're a big book lover, this is love this part of the big book. Yeah, I mean, he, this is this is a lot to love here, really. So it says, without knowing it, had we not been brought to where we stood by a certain kind of faith. Now, why we were brought there without knowing it was also was based by a certain kind of faith, faith in self. So without knowing it, had we not been brought to where we stood by a certain kind of faith, for, we, for did we not believe in our own reasoning? I do not believe the reasoning is our own. I don't. Because you think way too much like I do for it to be mine. Yeah? And I think way too much like you for it to be yours. So this idea that it's my reasoning is really the bondage of self. Truly, I feel so did we not have confidence in our ability to drink, to think, to drink too, to think? What was this, what was that but a sort of faith? Yeah. So every one of these sentences ends with a, a, a question mark. So we're meant to dwell on each one of these. Yeah, because obviously, when we hear it, it goes against the way we think things are. We believe I brought myself to my own demise, but it's saying faith brought you to where you find yourself. It is. Unless your name is Faith, then there should be no identi identification. Like there may be one lady at the Zoom that her first name is Faith. So I could see that she would think it's a description of her. But we, we don't, that's not our name. Yeah, <laughs> so it's not talking about you. It's talking about faith. All right, so what was that but a sort of faith? Yet we have been faithful, abjectly faithful. And a lady here shared what abjectly means, which means spiritless, 
servility. Incredible. What a statement. Spiritless, completely dominated by the head, servility. I would say you could describe it as bondage of self. Spiritless servility is pretty pretty close to bondage of self. Yeah. <laughs> what was that but a sort a sort of faith? Yes, we had been faithful, abjectly faithful to the God of reason. This is the first part of saying, first, you gotta quit playing God. You are not that which is playing God. It's this that is playing God. We had been faithful, abjectly faithful to the God of reason. So in one way or another, we discovered that faith had been involved all the time. Now, whatever time it is where you are, in whatever zone, it's still all the time. It's part of all the time. Yes? All the time means all, every last second of it, time. So all the time faith had been involved all the time have you ever heard that description of your of a day in your life i hadn't i never heard that do you hear that emphasized a lot at meetings i don't know do you think it's revelatory i do yes because being brought and getting there yourself are completely different. Being driven and being the driver is completely different. Yeah? So what, what your understanding is, if you believe you were that which brought you somewhere, that's a misunderstanding to the statements in the book. It says we were brought by faith to where we find ourselves. So I didn't drive the car, faith drove the car. 